Hey everybody, Danelle with Danelle's Kitchery here, and I have with me today Sassy Stephanie from Stephanie Harris, also known as the Memoirs of Long Arm Quilter. And before I say hey to everybody in the chat individually, I'll go ahead and let her introduce herself and talk about her channel some. So Stephanie. Hello everybody, you all know me as Sassy or Sassy Steph of Memoirs of a Long Arm Quilter. My channel name is also Stephanie Harris, so you can't mix it up, okay? It's one of those. Um, I am professionally a long arm quilter. I also love to do projects with um, um, my commu quilting community here on YouTube. I also have a Facebook group um, page called Sassy's Quilting Tribe. I'm over on Instagram too, so you know, if you have ever in need of company as you are sewing your projects, come find me over on Memoirs of a Long Arm Quilter. So in the chat, we have a bunch of early birds today. We have Michelle's Crafts and More. Hello, my love. Got okay. Inquilt Fett, Mama Debbie. And I see here a Joydy. And then Mama Jean from Jean Captain Stitches. Andrea Jean, hello, hello. And then we have people talking. And then we got Miss Handmade by Ying Madonna. Hello, my Master Squirrel. And then, <laughs> Sis, and then Sissy Squirrel Day is here. And Miss Glinda Hyde. And okay, it looks like I covered everybody so far. <laughs> Cool beans. Hello. There's uh, several of you guys. I was trying to zoom through it fast, but at the same time, still hit everybody. Awesome. <laughs> and then we got Joyce Hernandez joining in. So today, we Stacy has already completed all her blocks for her lion. No, not Mr. All of Lincoln. Them. Oh not no. Yet. No, I'm. On I the thought you got them. I'm on the last one. Oh my goodness! I thought you had them all done, girl. No, not yet. No, I'm, I'm, I'm still working. <laughs> I'm on H2. Well, you're a lot further than me. I'm on B1. <laughs> <laughs> Felt like I just called out a bingo. <laughs> right? No, I, I'm still trucking along just like you guys. Alrighty, so while she's working on her row, I'm going to be working on my B1, which Ari lifted up is actually just all one color. But you know me, I got to make it complicated and still have those seams. So <laughs> I'm like, why not add a little extra work in there? Just, just a little bit. It's okay. At least it's all one color. So true. Oh. I just feel like it actually holds better and still looks the same if I have that piece. <laughs> and it's going to look fabulous. Bad. Yes. It's not even look even better once I send it to you to quilt it. Uh oh. You are uh -huh. on. I am like, girl, don't have me messing yeah, I'm like, you know, that is oh, sorry, Andrea. Let me go fix that for you, my love. Oh, I am getting horrible. Andrea, I'm gonna need you to send me a message every so often when you need <laughs> me to draw the captions. Oh my goodness, gracious, I am off my game lately. I swear. What does she need? Please, sorry, not today. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. I remember I was able to do this last time. What you trying to do? Turn on my captions, my closed mm -hmm. captions. I, I was able to do it last time and everything. So let's see if I can get it to play nice.
You find it? I don't know. I mean, I know <laughs> I found it. I'm just trying to. Okay, there it is. So this guy's good to let me. For whatever reason, it's not letting me do it right now. Let's see. While Danielle is looking that up, is anyone else out in the chat working on the legit lion or plan on working on their legit lion? <laughs> Oh, the bird said, yeah. He's always saying something. <laughs> All right, so I think I may have gotten it. We'll see. Let's see here. Now. Maybe give it a minute to see if it actually starts working. I know that YouTube is a little bit behind the whole, like, when we're talking also. Yeah, there's a delay. Yeah. <laughs> so, Jean kept in stitches. Mama Jean says, Sassy, your hair is changing the meaning of your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's changing the meaning of my shirt. That's what she said. I'm not really fresh. I'm a little confused. Well, I'm getting closer, closer every day. <laughs> okay, maybe he'll calm down now. I just let him out, so. Hey, Mary L, thank you for joining. She says today is the first time she's here. Oh, welcome, welcome. And hi, Teresa, how are you doing? Or Teresa Foister, sorry about that. Oh, Teresa, that was just me trying to asking a few of my regular content or a few of my regular people to. Oh, okay. She said that your hair is covering up the C in closer. So it's like looking like your shirt says loser, loser. every day. <laughs> Oh, it's covering up the meaning. Okay, let me, let me, um, let's change that, honey, because I don't want to be going to lose her. <laughs> that is funny. Now I get it. <laughs> We're going to put it all the way up, okay? <laughs> We're going to put it all the way up. Yeah, for whatever reason, I cannot seem to figure out how to turn on post caption I know I did it before and for whatever reason it's not working and I'm getting fussy because it's not working let's see I will figure this out I'm wondering if it has, um, are you into the studio? Like yeah, I'm inside the studio right now. Okay, and then you are- As see where the closed caption is, it just normally it will let me turn it on and it's not. Sometimes, have you ever done it during a live? Because I thought you couldn't do it in, in, while it's in, while you're live. I know you Last time I was able to do it during a live, 
I don't know if it was just a fluke in the system or what. But Andrea says it's okay that she's understanding most words. I am so sorry, Andrea. I will definitely make sure I get that turned on for now on for you. Hey, Eva Obok. Thanks for joining in, hon. I'm doing good. All right, so. I'm going to get back to folding paper then. <laughs> so what is everybody up to today? Anybody got any special plans or any awesome plans for Easter that's coming up soon? Oh my gosh. It's very soon. I know I'll be spending it with family, so that is going to be cool. Spending Unfortunately, my, my youngest one works that day, so it's just going to be me, my husband, and my oldest son, which is fine, too. Just sucks that my youngest one can't be here. Is he away, or...? No, I mean, he lives like about 15, 20 minutes from me, so not as far at all, but he's got, he has to work, mm. so he works like, usually like early afternoon, like 12, 1 o'clock until closing. Gotcha. So it's like seeing him is difficult because he is also like a night owl, likes to sleep in, refuses to get up early for anything that he is not required to get paid for. <laughs> yep, I know some of those. <laughs> But he does have that Monday. He always has Mondays and Tuesdays off. So he usually comes over on Mondays or Tuesdays to visit. I just decided to have a three-day weekend next weekend, so... Now for Motown, did you have most of those colors already in your stash? The only thing I bought was the white. Okay. I was going to do like various whites that I already had. That just like were white on white tongue. But most of the most of it was like snowflakes and I wanted something that was like a consistent design. So I decided to go with white on white starch. So I bought that. Everything else I'm using for Motown has all been in my stash already. Figured a good scrap buster. Let's see. Hey, Pieces Love and Quilting, how are you doing? Thank you for joining in. Hey, Courtney. Jean says that she is sure that Whip would have a great time finding plastic eggs in the yard. And Mama Debbie says, prepping for the Renegade Zoom this afternoon. No special plans for Easter. Now, you know, it's something when your 27 year old son wants to come over and die Easter eggs. <laughs> so, yeah. And well, we have chickens. This is our first year with chickens and they're laying their eggs. So he's super excited to see if we can die some eggs. And I'm like, I don't have. I have rainbow layer, so my babies lay green eggs. I have a blue egg layer. I have a brown, several, well, a brown, a cream, and a chocolate brown color. So he's thinking that, you know, he's going to be dying these eggs. And I'm like, okay, come on over. Bring the stuff because I'm not going to invest in it this year. But. <laughs> Yeah, that's when you know that they're thinking all about nostalgia. 
Right. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, that is so cute, though. So I'm like, my 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 baby want to die some eggs, and I'm sure my 18 year old daughter will be right in the kitchen, right along with him, <laughs> wanting to die some eggs. Wait, sir. Stop. Keep it bung on, put you back in your cage and put you in timeout. And yes, anybody that not, wants to know, I do put my bird in timeout by covering him up. He gets quiet time. That's his timeout. <laughs> He's like, no, it's not. <laughs> now, how you only have one bird? I got three, girl. Woo. Just Quasar is the nauseous one. Praise the one that the likes to make sure everybody's aware he is right here. <laughs> They're baby chickens, so I get it. C to D. Let's see. Okay, so everybody's having a conversation with themselves in here, which is cool. Yes. Did Ooh, anybody... that sounds fun. Jean, Captain C Mama Jean says, maybe I'll do some shaving cream dyeing on fabric on Easter. Haven't heard of that before, but okay. That is definitely interesting. I would love to see that. Hey, so Terry. Yeah, we're just gonna make some ham and we'll relax around the house. Probably watch some movies. I'll probably spend half of the day sewing, if not a lot of it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I will be at my mom's house um, and I will be there helping prepare food and also there to eat. <laughs> and of course, yes, my sibling. Yeah, since my kids have gotten older and don't really do much for the whole like Easter egg hunting and little kids stuff and everything anymore, then we don't really do much for Easter. So we do still make like a big dinner and do family time, but I mean, we do family time pretty much every night. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, Quasar, that's enough. Come on. Be right back, guys. I'm gonna go right here and put him into timeout. After I lure him into the cage with food. He's <laughs> like, what did I do? Something. Okay. Go on. Yeah, go get it. Uh -huh. paper pieces do not be afraid to date jack <laughs> say what say with foundation paper piece and do not be afraid to date jack oh no because you're gonna get very well acquainted with jack yes me and jack are bosom buddies <laughs> <laughs> He can keep his bride and date and self away from me. <laughs> yeah, I can't keep seem to get Jack to stay away from me, so. Me and Jack already hung out a few times today. <laughs> Before I even touch the paper piecing. And the sad part about it is if I remember to do what I say I do 
and don't go through the whole seam, I wouldn't have to rip off the whole thing. I just have to rip off some of it. Now, that just seems like it'd be way too easy. I know, right? <laughs> It's just too easy. And I should have went with my first instinct of just doing just the entire sheet since this whole piece here is white anyway. But no, I had to be more complicated. <laughs> of course. Like, why not add extra steps for me to do? All because I want to keep that peak look. Let's see here if I missed anything in the chat. Hi, Leticia. How are you doing? Hello, Leticia. She says she is making homemade bread. Ooh, that sounds good. Mm. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to have my husband, my hubby and son time make up. They do this amazing homemade honey bread. And it is like, it, it pretty much tastes like you're like you're cheating on a diet because of how good it tastes. Mm. <laughs> That's my kind of bread. <laughs> uh-huh. Now does Leticia have a channel? Um, I do not know. Anybody that does have a channel, you can feel free to hit exclamation selfie into the chat and it'll share your channel. Hey Aisha, how are you doing, hon? Aisha said, hi, Danelle and Stephanie. Hello, hello. Aisha, we are working, both working on our Legit Kit Lions. And I'm doing my, since I'm in Michigan, I'm doing mine in Detroit Lions colors. So my lion would not look like a traditional lion. <laughs> And I don't know if Sassy has done anything differently to hers or not. I cannot remember offhand. Um, I only changed some colors out. Like the rock, instead of it being green, I had never seen an all green rock. I mean, I'm sure they probably exist because of, you know, moths and all that kind of stuff. But I wanted it to be more rock color like. So I changed that. And I also changed in his face there's a lot of green in his face and i understand how they have the sun on this side and the shadowing on this side but it's a little intense they green because it's really really bright yeah, yeah I didn't want that in kind of face. like sticks out like a sore thumb yeah so i did change that up a little bit um yeah, those are the things that I changed, and I'm hoping, and green is my favorite color, and the jungle is green, so I left all the green, like, behind him the way that it called for it, so I don't know. I, lo I really love how Becca's turned out, Janine's turned out beautifully, Donna's turned out, even though she's keeping it under wraps. I think hers turned out beautifully <laughs> as well. Because she's waiting for, you know, the big reveal. So I am Yeah. Oh my gosh. Becca's it. came out beautiful with the way that she did her background and everything. And yes. oh my gosh. Yes. So um I believe that um each lion and for everyone who really you know participated is gonna be something unique about each one of the lions and um, like my lion is Lincoln. I think he's going to be absolutely gorgeous. He's going to be absolutely gorgeous. Oh, definitely. Yeah. And I wasn't part of the challenge or anything. I just decided to join in and do the lion too, because I love the lion. Mm -hmm. It's so cool. And several people were saying, 
saying something in the chat about someone should do it in the Detroit Lions colors. And I'm like, well, I'm like, I'm the only other Michigan girl on there that I know of. So I might as well just go ahead and do it in the Michigan Lion colors because <laughs> I got all this fabric laid around. And I just couldn't help myself. And I got it and I'm looking at it and I'm like, what did I do? <laughs> <laughs> my meat and my big mouth? What did I commit to? And if you guys see me keep looking at my fabric, it's because my fabric is tone on tone and I'm trying to figure out which side is the right side. <laughs> So my mm -hmm. star, so the little teeny tiny stars on the fabric, if you can see in everything, will still be able to be sh seen whenever I do the do the design. I'm trying yes. to make sure I keep the correct side up. Okay, Leticia says, no, she does not have a channel. She just enjoys watching and sewing. Awesome. And Asia says she's looking forward to seeing them when they're completed. Yes, you got to come over to my channel and check it out so you guys can see how the progress of Lincoln. Yes. I love the fact that you've been doing like those improv live streams lately. Uh-huh. Those have been so awesome to watch you go with this and everything, especially with how quickly it's been going. Yes. I hate that. You since know you've been doing like the improvs daily, then oh my gosh, it, it's going fast for you. So it feels like. Right. And I think if I would have done it earlier on, I probably wouldn't lost the momentum because like I said, when I got to row E, whew, I was ready to take this line and go shit shove it in a drawer somewhere <laughs> i was like i'm sick of this lion girl i was like that before by the time i got done picking my fabrics <laughs> i was like okay that was enough i'm done <laughs> yes because it's just like what in the world did um i get myself into but like cause, again it was because i did little hooter and that one was really intense. And actually that one is a hard, supposedly harder than this lion. And I'm like, oh, what did I do? What did I do? But it's almost, I'm getting to a point where I'm on this last row and starting to see the sunlight through the trees. <laughs> uh, girl, you got this. I know you got this. Yes. And you know you got this. Oh yeah, because I, I definitely would probably wouldn't be here, but because I'm that close to, you know. Yeah, I was in there watching yeah. your your lives and everything. I'm like of your improv lives. I'm like, man, I'm like, I hope to God she has some left over for my life. Oh yes. <laughs> oh, I would have been assembling. <laughs> That's where I, I thought you actually were at. I was like, oh my gosh. No, 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 just. Just started um, H last night, but you know I'm I'm not looking forward to taking all this paper out. But I think I came up with an easier solution and how to do it. So I'm gonna um, make sure I dampen it up just a little bit, soften the seams up a little bit with just a little water to loosen it up to get them to come out a lot easier. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, because it's pulling this paper. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's a pain in the butt. Oh, that's a good idea, Andrea. She goes, put a piece of tape on the right side that you can move, and then you would not have to keep rechecking to figure out which side is the right side. Oh. <laughs> Hey, Sass, you want to do an uh, exclamation selfie into the chat, or do you want me to just share your link on there? You can go ahead and share it, because I'm not I'm not in the chat. Okay. Mama Jean, are you still here? Or so, Terry, can one of you guys drop her, drop Sassy's link for me? You know what? Let me see if I can get them to, if they're not available. Yeah. 
my camera keeps connecting as if it's ready to go. <laughs> I'm like, no, nah, don't do it. It's like, you want to go live, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> hey, Pop and Quilter. How are you doing, hon? I was going to say, if they don't do that, I can always go on there and grab it for you real quick. I, think I just got in here. So me. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, I didn't realize you didn't have your phone and everything up and ready. <laughs> oh, no. I, yeah, I forgot you couldn't see the everything. chat and all. <laughs> I'm getting there. Okay, it's in there. Yes, ma'am. So there you guys go. Anybody that wants to follow Stephanie, there's her channel. Thank you. Thank you. And our girl Stephanie is just a few away from reaching the goal of 1,000. Yes. So let's awesome. get her over there, people. Yes. And the giveaway. I will be having a 1K giveaway as soon as I get confirmation from YouTube that they um confirm that i'm over a thousand they usually do it like at a thousand and like five or something like that because they'll scrub and make sure that my followers are you know they're currently and really want you know then people some people will yeah making sure that there's no imposters right and um so as soon as they say oh sassy congratulations you hit that milestone i will be doing a giveaway and the giveaway is an Alyssa m3 pro mini iron so i think someone is going to be a very happy winner so definitely hey mona hey mona <laughs> Uh, Jean goes, sorry, Sassy, a bit slow today. She goes, I just got to it at the same time that you did. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's okay. I was like, oh, let me get in here. And then this way my camera can stop um, coming on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And for anybody that may be curious, I'm only doing an hour today, so got a lot going on. Yes. Debbie says, oh, sassy, you're so sassy. I want to win that. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I think it's, it, um, I know that. I had a mini. I'd end up selling it because my fingers are are too long for it. It, it was just uncomfortable in my hand. But I just, now I do have the big one. But I'm like, oh my gosh, I, I just really love this iron. So I wanted to give something that I want so bad, but I can't use it. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, oh. Let me surprise somebody else with it. And it's the newer one. And who doesn't like new and cute stuff? It is a core, it's a pink, it's a coral pink. I already have it. Um, see, that would just look perfect in my space with all my pink. Yeah, see? <laughs> see, you guys got to enter to win. Yes. And I probably won't enter, but just because I don't want to take away from anyone else. And the fact that I already got some uh, several irons. Right. And that's the good thing. I mean, because there are so many people who reached out and said the exact same thing. I want to let, let give it to one of your subscribers. And I'm like, oh, thank you. But you no, know, it's still open to you. <laughs> <laughs> it's still open. 
Yeah, my thing, I'd much rather see it, it go to a subscriber because I already got plenty of irons. Like, I got, I have one over there that is, like, 20 years old. The one you see me sitting right there. Uh -huh. I think it's, like, 20 years old, and it's still kicking booty. <laughs> yeah. I normally use that one for, because uh, that one there, I used to use on my, my husband got it for me whenever he had to work in an office setting, and I always had to iron his clothes. And, boy, I hated doing that. <laughs> so I was so happy when he tried and got to a point where he was working from home and I no longer had to iron his clothes. And then I became a quilter and learned I had to iron everything. <laughs> I know, right? You like, dang, only thought I was done. We did that chore. <laughs> now I finger press as much as possible. <laughs> I think it's one of the reasons why I love batik so much. I don't have to iron that really too much. Right. Okay. This is off like by an eighth of an inch. And I just, I can't live with it. I can't live with it. And reason being is because it's um, a dark next to a white. If they were the colors were similar, I wouldn't even care. But because it's such a contrast in the colors, I need these colors to match up and just a little bit better. Guess what I'm supposed to have Tuesday? The paper piecing ruler, 12 inch ruler from Fallon. Oh, you'll love it. Yes. You will love it. Wait. Now it doesn't have the lip like the quarter um, at a quarter. But, Which is fine because I mean I normally just use my normal ruler anyway, so because right. I've misplaced my at a quarter. But uh, for is the trimming process? Oh my gosh, it's amazing! It is amazing. Yeah, because it's got like that little line there for a quarter inch line anyway, so it right. is really all I need. Then the fact that it has a handle, so I ain't got to sit there and try to mess with this thing anymore. Mm-hmm. Sliding. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sliding. Cause I'm like, I'm horrible at it sliding. So I just have to go extra slow just in case. Yeah. The grip on it is amazing. Yeah. The I have her quilting one. The, it's like a four by six or whatever quilting one that has like the one inch lines on it. Uh -huh. I have that one and I love it. So the trim lock block rulers. Um, the different one. this one right here, actually. Oh, I didn't see that one. And the lines on it are like one inch apart. Oh, wow. Huh. Yeah, it's a quilting ruler. And I actually used it to quilt this fabric here. And it works so beautifully. Like zero problems in my fabric slipping or anything else like that underneath the needle. It was awesome. I have to look at look into that one, and it's called the quilting ruler. I believe it's a quilting ruler. I cannot remember one hundred percent for sure, but B one is done. See how uh -oh. pretty all my white is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nice when they're just like that one page, and you don't have to easy to square up. Real easy. <laughs> yeah. But of course, I had to go the difficult way and add, uh, add in all the seams. So, but my thing is, yeah, it will be nice, really, really nice if if it can. There was a way that they didn't have to have. I know with um, legit kits and probably with anybody to be exact, when they're doing foundation paper piecing, to not have so many bloody pieces. I don't mind all the detail, like if you're doing it within a page, but I do mind this because we have to line this stuff up. Sometimes it can be difficult. In a yeah, I actually found a site that had some free paper piecing patterns. Went to go get one of them, like the Minecraft honeybee. Oh uh -huh. my gosh, those little legs on that honeybee are so teeny tiny like less than a half an inch Ooh. i'm like i went to start doing it i'm like yeah no this is not working 
I'm like, we're, I'm like, either A, either my B's not having legs, or B, I just don't do this. <laughs> and I started looking through it and everything more, and I'm like, there's a whole lot of teeny tiny pieces on that thing. I'm like, I'm going to have to figure out how to blow this up because this is just not working out. I'm like, that thing is just like way too tiny for me. And I don't really like dealing with pieces that are like less than an inch. Mm -hmm. I'll go a little bit smaller, like three quarter, half an inch. If it's like a, uh, with a foundation paper piecing, because there's a little bit more foundation there to deal with, opposed to just two loose pieces of fabric that you're piecing. But mm -hmm. even that was a little too much. I'm like, no, 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 no. <laughs> Right, you want to make sure. Hey, Beverly, how are you doing, hon? Thank you so much for coming into the chat and hanging out. Oh, Mama Jean says, See, sorry, she had her hands full of puppy. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's the best. Yes, that is the best excuse ever in the world. Though I wouldn't want to see one no time soon over here. <laughs> and but and Andrea and Mama funny. Debbie and Quilt Fed are messing with each other about your giveaway. Mama <laughs> Debbie says that if Andrea wins, she can she can still win it and just gift it to her. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, just so you know. <laughs> Oh. oh goodness gracious, ladies! You know how the, the saying goes. I wish I can give one to everyone. <laughs> oh, definitely! Like you're a winner. You're a winner. You're all winners. Look up under your seat. You know the Oprah moment. One day I will be there. Just not. <laughs> <laughs> definitely. Oh, well, we got about another 15 or 18 more minutes until we reach the one hour mark already. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That was quick. Yeah, it was. Having a glance up long ago. Whoa, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And I'm almost finished with um, H2. Awesome. So. I was looking earlier. I'm actually less than a thousand watch hours away from being able to create memberships for my channel. Oh, wow. You, wait, do what now? I'm like 1,000 watch hours away from being able to create memberships for my channel. Awesome. Yeah, I'm like, ooh. I think that's a part I'm looking forward to becoming monetized more than anything is being able to create memberships and do like the Zoom shows and everything with people because I love doing Zoom shows mm -hmm. and getting to know people better. Yes. Howie, that was my finger, not the paper. Okay. Let's see. What have I missed? Have I missed anything? Yeah. I did not even hear what it was. I was just giving you a hard time. I think, okay, Andrea was talking to Debbie about that. 
Hey, Sojo Quilty Stitching Things. Thank you for joining in. She didn't know what what was what the um giveaway the giveaway prize. I think so. It is the Aliso M3 Pro Mini Iron. It is super cute and one of the new ones by Aliso. And a lot of places they keep having them on back order, so evidently there this the demand for them. I think a lot of the demand is the fact that it's Aliso. Yes. <laughs> so true. Because when we were at QuiltCon, um, Carolina Moore was sitting there and she was blinging out one, even though um, she was putting all a whole bunch of rhinestones on a lot. Oh, is that that gold one that uh, that Ian showed on his uh, on his video? Yes, and I'm like, oh my god, that thing was gorgeous. Yes, but when it's at that state, it's um, you know, you can't use it, and I'm like, I hope that was a busted one <laughs> <laughs> because that's a lot of money to be spending on the iron just to you know bling it up. Yeah, definitely. I didn't even think about the fact that that just wouldn't even be usable anymore. I was like, yeah, no. Maybe once this one goes to Pooey, I can, you know, maybe I will bling her up, but it's going to be not until then. Yeah, I did. Unfortunately, I did have one Alyssa iron before. And my husband actually got me a mini for Christmas a few years ago. Mm -hmm. And I did never know about their, like, their warranty and stuff like that. I just knew that, I mean, it worked. It just, the steam, the water, the steam portion of it never worked. Mm. And I didn't know about the warranty and how good they were about taking care of their customers and everything within a timely manner or whatnot. Mm -hmm. And I threw mine out. Oh, wow. No, the only problem I had with my big one was, um, though I did not keep water in the iron um this was one of my in my steaming days of course but um i the tube where the water comes in and out of even though there was water not left in the iron it like stained the um that and so it looks brown and it was giving off all kinds of gunk but once i cleaned it completely out with um baking soda and vinegar once i done that cleaned it out really really well i didn't hadn't had any problems out of it it's perfect yeah i had a problem with that with my uh really expensive rowenta because mm -hmm. my larger iron that i use on an everyday basis was a rowenta and that one it worked beautifully for like forever and then all of a sudden it just kept like no matter what, the water would just come out completely brown and staining everything. Yes. And I had cleaned it and cleaned it and cleaned it, and it just was not. It would not stop. I don't know what was going on with it. And that's. The thing. And so I finally just said heck with it, threw that out, and went to Big Lots and bought a cheap twenty dollar iron. I'm like, I'm done spending money on stuff I can't that keeps breaking on me. Right. And then if anything marked quilting is going to be expensive. Yeah. So I'm like, you know, so I just went to Walmart, got this cheap black and decker, like, or not Walmart, but uh, Big Lots got this cheap black and decker. I'm like, she's beautiful. Works perfectly. Yep. And that's okay. Yup. I'm like, obviously, I am not meant for an expensive iron. <laughs> right. Cause I that make you know that'll make a person be like this again, make you mad. And like you said, you you know at that time you didn't think about you know you know contacting them, letting them know. But uh, yep. And Joydy is asking. She just woke up and is curious because she she heard something about a giveaway, but she didn't hear any details. So 
Would you like to answer that? Yes, there will be. Um, I am less than 75 away from having 1,000 subscribers over on my channel, Memoirs of a Long Arm Quilter. I will put it back in the chat. Um, once YouTube confirms that I am over 1,000, I will be hosting a giveaway, and the giveaway is for an Aliso M3 Pro Mini Iron in the color Coral. So, um, I've been asking people to go out, of course, subscribe and tell your friends and your family to go and subscribe so we can get over that 1,000 mark. But not only subscribe, guys, and please don't subscribe just for a chance to win and then all of a sudden disappear. <laughs> come in and, you know, come and chat with your girl, you know. Every month, now and then, it would be nice to um, of course. To case note, meet. check out her channel, and if you like the content, subscribe, yeah. right? But you know, I, building a small building any kind of community is difficult, but when the, you people are doing it just to win prizes, this kind of you know, it's sad, but it makes you sad because you really do want to get to know people. I do. I really, really do. So that now for anybody that is curious, I will be back at my normal time tomorrow. We just had some scheduling issues and everything, which is the reason why we did the later uh, show for today. So, which is actually nice and worked out great because I woke up and my brain was just not working. <laughs> I was like, okay, I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna do this, 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 and this, and this. So I got up, made coffee, and after that, nothing else worked out, <laughs> well, including good. my brain. So I'm like, yeah, no, nope. worked out. <laughs> yes, I'm like, it was meant to be for me to be late today. <laughs> no, or for me to have my group. I couldn't believe. I was like, oh my gosh, wait a minute. I've overcommitted. <laughs> I love the fact that when you John had messaged me about that, you it's like you weren't just canceling. You were just you just wanted to postpone it just a little bit. Yes. I'm like, no, and that I, was that was that spoke beyond 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 words to me because I'm like, okay, I'm like, she's she's not bailing on me. No. I'm like she still I, wants to do it. Yes. I still wanted to be a part of it and I because that's, you know, some, especially if you're, you know, you've told your community and stuff like that. I don't want to, you to look bad and nor do I want to look bad. You know what I'm saying? I just, I want everybody to win in this situation. And I'm like, there is no reason why I couldn't, you know, after, you know, my commitment with the veterans, I am a, uh, well, of course I'm female. I am a veteran. So I had my support <laughs> group today. So I, I definitely didn't want to not honor that commitment. And I also wanted to make sure I kept my commitment to you because to me, my word is all I have. And oh, definitely, um, that's, that's one of the things that, you know, people look at. So I definitely didn't want to. Only thing would have stopped it is of course, an uh, illness that, I, that I couldn't, but other or than no that, internet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it's funny because we have we had storms rolling through here and I'm like please don't do this right now <laughs> and it, when I came live they got really quiet so I'm like yes yes I'm winning <laughs> it was destiny yes. hey Leanna hey Loretta thank you for joining in Han hello hello Yeah, Mama Jean kept in stitches. Mama Jean is also a veteran. Awesome. Yeah, she does a lot of charity quilts, especially for her children. Oh, wow, that is cool. Yeah. Yeah, Sojo said that she is 
the uh she is glad that we postponed because otherwise she wouldn't have been able to watch at an earlier time. Oh, okay. Jean, thank you so much for your service too. What branch were you in? Yeah, I've actually been kind of thinking about changing my Saturday time to maybe around this time frame in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. Because it seems like more, pe more people will be able to watch from other areas of the world and then try and keep my Sunday show to my 10 a.m. So that way there, because I do a live on Saturday and Sunday, so that's what I'm thinking. But Mama Jean says she was in the Air Force. Awesome. Now, which branch were you in? Army. Okay. Army, okay. Army grads. Army grads. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Okay, my H2 is complete. This Ooh, is the rock. Pretty. Starting, the rock is starting to form right here. So. That's uh, so pretty. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I just got to brush it so. off. I got B to A done. Cool. Got a little bit of the main down here. And then B to B. I'm, I'm, I'm scared, guys. I'm scared. Look at all this. Honey, that, well, I'm telling you, you're going to be like, oh, that was a piece of cake when you, until when you get to that C row. I'm telling you. The, those eyeballs? Those eyeballs. Yeah, I, I've heard all you guys talking about the eyes. I, well, I'm you know really what? Writing that. I don't know why Donna was um, stressing because Donna, she does this. This is like her living. I was stressing because it, that mess was hard for me. <laughs> yeah, the was giraffe like, I was. Know why I listen to her. <laughs> yeah, the giraffe was your very first one, wasn't it? Um, but my giraffe was by by the craft. So to me, that was a lot easier. Now, her eyes and hers was intense too. I'm not gonna tell you no story. That one was kind of intense though, because it was so tiny. But um, that was my first big uh, project, um, FPP project. I've done many small projects. Yeah, this is officially the first one I've gotten this far on mm -hmm. because I had the Vortex. I signed up for the Vortex way before I ever signed up for this one, but I haven't gotten very far on it. And I'm like, you know what? After I started working on this one and talking about this one so much and everything, I'm like, you know, I'm like, I'm finishing this one and then I'll go back to the Vortex, finish that up. Mm -hmm. And then I got the iris down here waiting for me too. Uh-oh. <laughs> Now that's the one I really wanted. I should have gotten that one. I should have jumped in on the member monthly membership one because I would love to have gifted that one to um, my eye doctor. But I don't know why. I just I just didn't do it. I just didn't do it. So once it's available again, I might reconsider getting it for like. But if it was I wanted it just because for one, I thought it was like super cool because I love anatomy. Uh huh. And it's just like anatomy and physiology, like just really is is like my oohs and ahs. Mm hmm. And then the fact that it's a blue eye, and I got blue eyes. So. Okay. Let's trim. These dog ears off. Mama Jean says she wants to do the rose. I think I got that one saved on my computer still. Figure eventually I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do all the flowers. I want to do all the flowers. I want to do all the birds. And the cats. And <laughs> My wish list is a very long wish list. But we are at the one hour mark, people. I think we're going to go ahead and call it quits here. Yay, we made Before it. this one here starts giving me too much of a headache. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, hey, I, can, 
I see Jack is going to be coming out to hang out on that one. So I can just see it. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> oh, definitely. But everybody, go show us some love over at Stephanie's channel. She's already dropped her link a few times. Plus, it's also in the description box of my down below. Um, make sure you hit those thumbs up. Give me some watch hours, guys. Yes. And uh, help me get to that monetized part so that way there I can be able to create memberships for you guys. And we can be able to do Zooms together and all. Have fun and hang out. That'd be cool. Yes. Be a lot more fun than just me talking to a screen. <laughs> Definitely. Everybody have a wonderful day. Take care and make sure you smile.